you know what, as spawns go, I'm not gonna lie, this one is pretty sensational. Here's the deal, Cineworld are offering you the chance to win an Unlimited card. An Unlimited card is, frankly, the best thing I've ever owned in my life. Apart from... No, best thing I've ever owned in my life. That sounds like spawn talk of the vomit-inducing variety. I know I sound like a corporate hack, but I promise you, they didn't ask me to say that. That's my real emotion. Do you remember those? Emotions? Good times. You take the card, you go down to your local world of Cine, and you say, hello, one ticket to Darren Aronofsky's mother, please. At least you should say that. And then they take it, they scan it, they give it back to you, along with a ticket to see the movie. Perfect. During the trailers, while eating a code-compliant snack, you're like, movies are great, I should see more movies. And then you finish the film, you go grab some lunch, you turn around, you walk right back into the box office, and you say, hello, a ticket to Patty Cakes, please. Good sir, slash madam, slash neither, slash both. And then you see that one as well, because you have an unlimited card. The golden ticket to Hollywood. If I come up with a new slogan, will they pay me more? You know how I feel about movies, they're my escapism any time of the day or night, and recently I've been invited to a lot of early morning screenings, which are one of the few things it's worth dragging myself out of bed before 9.30 for. Incidentally, another one of those things is hotel breakfast. So much talent and craft goes into making a movie, I just think everything on screen has been produced painstakingly by skill... mongers of the highest standard. But what's wonderful is that those people got to that standard by sheer commitment to their craft, part of which was going to see as many movies as possible. But another part of it is just going out and making stuff, like not being put off or afraid of a lack of budget. You know, they go out and if they want to get better, they just make something rubbish and learn from it. For instance... Hi Chloe, are you sure you can't help me come and film this? It's just there are loads of people looking at me and it's really awkward. Oh, I'll buy you a chip special. You've changed. We best hurry. I must get the magic USB stick to space or the entire series won't happen. I'm with the force the force is with me. I'm with the force the force is with me. And the next time will be better. Also, when you're starting, I know I've struggled with this, don't be afraid of not being original. There's a theory that there are only seven basic plots and that if you try, you can fit every story into at least one of them. And if you think of any trailblazer in the film industry, they all take their cues from their own inspirations and many films are often an ode to a well-known theme. I mean, if anything, Hollywood seems a bit turned off by originality, to be honest. We're still firmly in reboot town. There's nothing they love more than taking a well-known classic and just dressing it up for the now, making it modern. Sometimes it does lose a bit of the charm. Feed the birds, 12 pounds a bag. Sorry, I haven't got anything to actually feed you with. It was just a comedy bit, mate. I've said it before, I think we can learn so much about the world through art, so any excuse to get more people through the box office and into a cinema is all right. In my book, I'm gonna jump on that, thanks. Just getting people to a place where they might see something that changes their life, or at the very least, changes their mind. Or even better, inspires them to make something that might make someone else change their mind. If you want to be in with a chance of winning the unlimited card, it is distressingly simple. Seriously, I wanted you to pass an obstacle course. They told me we didn't have the budget, and the insurance premium was too high, they wouldn't cover the flaming runway. I tried. Earlier in this video, there were two hilarious cutaways, and to be in with a chance of winning, all you have to do is head down to the old comments and identify one of them with the hashtag Cineworld Sites. And to help you along, down in the description is a blog post for you to have a gander at and basically find the answer, if I'm honest. That's it. Get involved. Maybe win a year of free movies. Thanks, Cineworld, for the bounty you're offering. That's really very generous of you. And thank you for watching. Good luck. I hope you win. You specifically.